So this is the Weeder Ultimate Body Works. I um, went ahead and wanted to actually give you guys a decent video. I didn't see any on Amazon of how it really works. So just briefly, this is my second floor apartment. You can kind of see where it sits against the wall. This is being taken uh, off of the cell phone, the video, so just bear with me a little bit. Down there we can see the length uh, down to the foot plate, about seven feet long. Um, also down here actually we have the tension cables that you can probably read about in the product description. Um, adds, I believe, an extra 50 pounds to the actual uh, body weight that you have. Over here, you'll see the, let me go to the other side. This side, this is where you can adjust the height. You can see the various levels. This is at the, the highest level. Basically, you pull the pin, it'll slide down. Can't do it with one hand. Um, you can kind of see the chin-up bars, the cables. Um, effectively, this is how the board moves. You can kind of hear the sound it makes. Whenever it goes down, you will notice that this is what it hits. So you got to be slightly careful with it. Um, it's really not too hard. You just slowly let yourself down. And I will go ahead and do a couple little things so you can kind of see how the board moves. Not for exercises for you to really do because I'm not a personal trainer, but just so you can kind of see uh, how the machine works, how it sounds when somebody's actually doing some exercises on it. So. When you come up to it, it's a little awkward. Um, at first, I really didn't know what to do with it. So you sit down, push up on the plate to reach back, which can be a little awkward at times, but it's not too bad. Grab the handlebars, then you kind of pull yourself up. And so this is how you know you do your chest exercises. You'll hear it sliding up and down. Um, like I said, you slowly let yourself down. It's really not that bad. Um, then you turn around. This is how you do some other exercises, curls and whatnot. Go ahead and lift. Rose and other. Um, let's see here. You can also do uh, some chin-ups. You know, just you gotta bend your legs a little bit, but it's really not that bad. Go under with it. It's an inside. Like I said, you just kind of slowly let yourself down. Uh -huh. So this is the highest level you can add tension to it. it will increase the resistance. Um, you can also lower it down. It will make it easier because gravity is what it uses. So you can go farther down and get on them if you wish. Um, that's just a brief overview of how it works. You can see how stable it is, 6'3", 6'4", 175 pounds. Um, and you can kind of go ahead and go to my actual written statement as well for further details.